So this is a snail trap, and all it is, it's a spring trap. It's just a branch here off a tree, piece of rope, or you could use just a double vine or some type of cordage tied to a little stick here, which is your trigger, and a noose here at the end. Basically, these sticks here are just a way to funnel the animal, and you want to keep them pretty close to the trap. This could be used to catch a monitor lizard, a chicken, a wild cat, a road runner, or any type of small game. Okay, so basically this, hopefully we want this to be the game trail, so to speak. We want the animal to come through here. Here's how it's going to work. You're going to take your, your trigger and with I've got two sticks, two pieces of bamboo. First one's going to come under these um, pieces of wood off of a tree, but with a little Y here. You take a Y and you pound them down in the ground. You've got a second one that's identical. Then you're going to take the second stick. That's going to lay flat against the sticks down here. Oop. Sure, I get that in. I want to get that. So now the trigger is set. And I'll take it down a little bit to hair trigger it. Then, you're going to put your floor in. When the animal steps on one of these three sticks here, it's like a pressure plate. The weight forces it down, and then we're going to make... the lasso here. We put that on there. So the animal comes down. It steps here. And it's very quick action, watch. Catches it. And it's a hanger. It hangs the animal. So again, small game works great. And the other thing you have to remember around these type of traps is you can't set one or two. You got to set 20 or 30. You can make 20 or 30 of these in a in a short fairly short period of time with multiple traps you're going to catch a few animals. That's how it works.